Hey loves, I know you know what this video is about, right? Mousman's visa is out, guys. Damn. Let me show you guys. Just hold on. Be patient. Guys, I am so, so happy because right now the journey has just begun. Remember in my previous video, I told you that he got a mail that his passport was ready for collection, right? But we were unsure of what the decision was and we were kind of scared. You know, anything is possible in Nigeria or in the UK. They might just want to deny your visa because of these their new laws. So we're kind of scared. But right now, I am so, so happy. His visa is here, it's sure. So right now, we are going to be booking his flights going to the UK. Mine should be coming out in a week's time. I don't know what my own decision would be, but I told you guys always that I am optimistic. I am always, always positive in everything that I do, and I trust God because there is nothing that God cannot do. I always tell you that there is nothing that God cannot do. Odogo is a shy person. He's supposed to be in this video, but he cannot come here and look at you people. So that's why I am doing this because, of course, I started this. I started this journey from when we started applying for um, admission, looking for admission. So if you've not been watching my other videos, then you should go watch other videos so you understand where I am coming from because it's been a long ride. It's been a long ride. I started from the scratch. So we are at the last phase. <laughs> Jesus. Just look at me. Some months ago, I was crying. Ha, ah, God, I am so, so grateful to God for this. I am grateful. We planned. We prayed. We did our best. We sought help. We researched, got information, the right information. We did not use any agents. We did this on our own with the help of God. As for the money, we saved a lot. Yes, we saved a lot. You know, in Nigeria now, depending on the country, the country you are watching this from in Nigeria, the current exchange rate is crazy. And you know, if you've not seen my previous video, you'll see how it affected us so, so badly that I even got depressed. <laughs> it affected us so, so badly, even after we planned, because I told you for every expense, expenses that we did, we had to like put it in our budget. We calculated everything. Everything was budgeted for, and we we're sure that the money that we saved, that we budgeted for this um, relocation plan, would be enough, and we will have enough to enter into the UK. But the current exchange rate swelled, almost felt it. But we are happy. We are finally here. Odogo has gotten his visa. Mine will be out, and I believe it's going to be a yes for me by next week. So make sure to subscribe so that you get to know what the decision would be. Mm -hmm. Click that subscribe button now. And I want to say thank you so much for always watching my videos. Thank you for giving this video a thumbs up, and thank you for your likes, your support, comments, everything that you do to support this channel. Thank you so, so much. This is not to discourage anyone also because I know some of you might be thinking, oh, you need 100 million to, before you can relocate. It's not like that. The goal is if you are planning to relocate, you need to save up money. Save up money and then save excess. If the plan is 10 million naira, you need to budget extra 5 million naira for you know miscellaneous things that might come up like what came up in our own case if we did not have extra money somewhere it would have been futile you know but thank god it was almost futile but thank god we we escaped <laughs> we escaped and we are here today we even did priority visa like i told you paid for priority visa extra 250 pounds each so so that it will come out within a week so i've done mine within seven days mine will be out so guys subscribe another thing that i would like to say is that do not be discouraged with the way things are going in the uk if it's not favorable to you you can as well check canada i know many of you love to come with your families like i and my husband i wish it's it's went well for you too like some of us but 
whichever way next year god will definitely bring another opportunity that will make you to live with your family so do not be discouraged you just need to keep on getting the right information just have a budget in the morning that you think will be enough make your findings and I pray your dreams come true sincerely from my heart. I pray your dreams come true. Let your relocation plan be successful as well. Thank you so much. God bless you. I can't wait to watch your old videos and hear your own testimonies too. I wish you guys well on your relocation plan. And if you are traveling this year, September, congratulations. If you've gotten your visa too, congratulations. I know what you went through because I went through the same thing. <laughs> I am coming from there, so congratulations, you've done where God has seen you through. So guys, we are going to be booking our flight tickets now, and that's it for now, bye! So guys, I decided to check British Airways first to confirm the price going to the flight fare from Abuja to Manchester directly. So this is British Airways, I see them the details from Abuja to Manchester the date you know school is resuming by september 23rd so i had to book like an earlier date but unfortunately for us the prices here they are incredible sincerely the prices here this is three thousand one hundred and eleven dollars this is five thousand nine hundred and something dollars you can see the outrageous prices the list is two thousand something dollars that's from 27 downwards and above so with the kind of prices that I saw here, yeah, I had to run away from British Airways. So now we've cal calculated highest 400,000 naira to book flight for each person. That's like 800,000 naira for the both of us. But with the kind of prices that we saw because of the dollar rate, man, it's really, really crazy. So I had to run away from British Airlines, so I rushed to Turkish Airlines. We went to Turkish Airlines to, you know, check the dates the prices from Abuja to Manchester, which was 21st of September, Thursday. So these are the prices. These are the available dates from 18th downwards. So these are the dates, 3,800 and something dollars. The list was on the 20th something of September. So you can see these are the prices. So before I made this video, we already booked the flight. But I had to make this video so that I would show you the current prices now. So you see how we went ahead to do that. And we noticed that then when it's time to pay, you can choose your preferred currency. But I didn't see Naira there. So this is how it is. These are, these are the details of the flight. You get to see the date, your arrival, okay, everything that you need to know, everything will be displayed. So if you are comfortable with it, the drop of and all that, you can proceed and then fill in your details. Because we've already booked the flight for Odogu, and um, I don't want to duplicate issues now, so I will not move past this place. So for you, you just have to fill in your details and click on continue. So guys, I've come to the end of this video. I hope you found it helpful and encouraging. Do it to subscribe and follow for more updates. Thank you guys. Bye.